It's time to earn your beads, ML Fanatics. We are live from the Terror Dome in New Orleans, Louisiana. And second thought, since most of you are trolls, orcs, and or uh, rotting, go ahead and keep those shirts on and just write the commission for your free beads. The teams are juiced up and ready for blood as they take the field for MFL action. The Nashville Lycans take on the New Orleans Zombies. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> Hello again, everybody. Grim Blitzrow here, along with Brickhead Mulligan. That's me! And his mutant hobbit head that lives on his shoulder, Bricks Jr. How about you shut the fuck up? Well played, Jr. Moving on. And he's running like a moose right now. And it's first and ten. And he was stuck to him like glue. Second down and ten. And he picks up about six on the play. Third and four. potato three potato four the defense just blew up a player who thought he was going to score <laughs> oh that hot potato dirty trick gets him every time and it's first and ten and he held on to that one for a first down does anyone have a rule book? Because that sounds like he's making stuff up. Ah, do we have a rule book? It's propping up your chair so you can reach the table without spilling your food, idiot. And this is a first and long. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down and forever. Oh man, I love this dirty trick. The quarterback unleashes a rock. His cleats are caked in blood and guts and he's looking to score. And lifesaver there. And it's first and 10. I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. And it's first and ten. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! <laughs> Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just guineas. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Yeah. 
And it's first and ten. That's a four yard gain. Second down and six. Just knocked him into the next time zone. Lucky finds his head. He'll be okay. And it's first and ten. You've got to catch that. Second down and ten. Quarterback is heading up and calls a murder ball dirty trick to lay waste to the defense. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. And it's first and ten. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it, too. Second down and ten. Quick pass picks up maybe two yards. Third down and eight. Caught for a first down. And it's first and ten. He took a beast boost injection. Now watch him stomp all over his opponents. I want to take a beast boost injection too. Uh, now that has weird side effects, Bricks. Through for a touchdown. Listen to this crowd. Hey. <laughs> and they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. First and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. Five-yard gain on that pass play. Hey, look at the coach. He's picking his nose. You know, they shouldn't put that on the Jumbotron. Seems like every time the camera shows him, he's either spitting, picking, grabbing himself in the privates. Hey, he should do it all at the same time. Now, that would be worthy of a jumbotron shot. Yeah, nice observation, Briggs. Great color work as usual. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. <laughs> and it's first and ten. hit and that'll be second down and four oh man the defense brought a sack once today hey hey don't eat him not a 
until he's cooked. And so at the end of one, we're all tied up. We'll be right back. Third down in. The punter is warming up. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. Defense holds him to a four yard pick up there. Second down and six. Pow with the brain scrambler. Third down and eight. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? And it's first and ten. Runs it for four yards. Second down and six. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> He picks up five on that play. Second down and five. Four yards on that one, and he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Third down and a pussy here. <laughs> he caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. <laughs> They're going for two. <laughs> when you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. And it's first and ten. The offense is pretty much unstoppable when they use their beast boost injection. Close your eyes, Bricks. This is going to get ugly. 
incredibly fast. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Ah, I don't think you can see that, Tim. Oh, boy. Look at that, he's such bullshit. This game is fucking rigged. I tell you, the programmers are speeding up the defense. I'm going to write an email to that fucker. And it's first and ten. He is fighting for every yard. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five on that play. Second down and five. That's a catch for a one-yard gain. That's not going to do it, fellas. Bricks, it's the two-minute warning. You know what that means? Whiskey? Third and four. That's a T-yard pass play, and that's not going to get it done. The offense needs to move the ball upfield. Either the defense is trying to keep some time on the clock for their offense, or someone let a real bonehead touch the controller. This one's so easy, they should call it Brett's mom. <laughs> Two jokes are the ones that hurt the most. He's got the distance, and the kick is good! The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! Oh, great tackle! When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And it's first and ten. Jack-in-the-box, Bricks. You never know when one of those hot potatoes is going to blow. You just crap your pants, Junior. They stop the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Uh, that's okay, Grim. They can have mine. That's, uh, that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors, and we need money more than they do. <laughs> and this guy is making a name for himself tonight with a pickup of about 10 on that play. Hey, it makes up a name. That's it. That's their last time out. It's them against the other team and the clock. Ah, that doesn't seem fair. I'm going to throw a hammer on the field and even the odds. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. He just got crushed. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. Oh, great throw. Great catch. And then put six points on the board. The defense could do anything to stop from throwing out good man. You mean aside from bribing the ref, killing the quarterback, or actually playing some D? Hey, Bricks, they're going for two here. And the defense stops him cold. That play just got blown to hell. Yeah, it got blown to shit. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. With a brutal hit. 
They stunt the clock with their first time out, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. Just follow the bloody footprints to the new line. That's a first down. The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room, and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. It's the start of the third quarter, and we are set to go, Bricks. Oh, boy! Where we going, Grim? A carnival? Huh? Uh, we're going to go to a strip tease show? Where we going? Hey, why don't you settle down? Just pet your rabbit, Lenny. Just pet your rabbit. <laughs> The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. And it's first and ten. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. And the quarterback throws a murder ball, which will slice its way through any defensive player trying to block it. This really puts the foot. Oh, that's a vicious hit, and the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant meat. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. And it's first and ten. First down! This guy just loves to hit people as hard as he can, Grim. I don't even think he knows what a first down is. And it's first and ten. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. It's first and ten. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown! Touchdown! At some point, they're going to need to put this rep out of his misery. Uh, how about now, for instance? Here's a hit. Dirty tricks attack the rep. <laughs> They're back up here on first, and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. First down in a mile. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. Second down in a mile. Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Catch the ball, asshole. Third down, and the offense needs a miracle. The offense just burned the defense pretty hard on that one. Oh, no. Just gotta scrape off the charred parts. Oh boy, they're going for it. This could get uglier than the baby resulting from an orcish family reunion. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was on to the races. Don't try to get 
get fancy here. It's a jailbreak, and the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Oh, crowd's loving it. Now there are some who would argue that we defense is enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. <laughs> Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. <laughs> the home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. Second down in a lot. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. Holds him to a four yard pick up there. Second down and six. He had it for a second there. Third down and six. Not going down. <laughs> you know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. Nice punt. Should move them back nicely. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburners. Punt returners in this league have a life expectancy of three returns. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. And it's first and ten. And that's a first down. Looks like they're just going to pound it up the middle all night, Bricks. They call that the honeymoon offense. I'm not going to touch that one. That's what she said. Defense better look out. The offense called the Beast Boost Dirty Trick. Touchdown! Listen to his fans howl. They love him. He came up with a teenage werewolf in the Mutant Farm League. I don't know if he's dancing or just marking his territory. <laughs> Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. 
They need a good return here to set up the offense. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. And it's first and ten. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And that'll be second down and four. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. If you don't hear it coming, he broke free and has open field in front of him. He's at the 10. Caught for the first down. And that brings us to the end of the third quarter. They'll need to fire on all cylinders to make a comeback in the final quarter. And it's first and 10. Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. Second down and six. And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. And this werewolf is from London, I believe, signed in the offseason. Yeah, I saw him at Trader Pink's hotel party the other night. His hair was perfect. Better watch out. He'll rip your lungs out, Bricks. No, well, why go for one when you could go for two? It's always been my philosophy, but Bricks can't even get one. Oh. And that's a good by the number throw. And those numbers add up to two. <laughs> Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chick. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my off season. And it's first and ten. The defense didn't give an inch. No gain on that play. Second down and ten. Oh, he almost broke that one wide open. Hey, speaking of breaking one wide open, who's sitting on the oil rig about to blow? Hey, smells like an oven big portage John in here. We're a freaking fracking accident waiting to happen. Don't nobody light a match. First down. And the running game opens up for them and allows the passing game to be more of a threat. Got to keep them guessing. And it's first and ten. He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. Second down and six. And he got it off. That's a decent punt.
and it's first and ten. And that pass finds its target. A pickup of six yards on the play. And that'll be second down and four. He might have managed to dig out a yard on that one. Not my yard. Got too much buried in, you know, the usual money, bodies, coffee cans filled with, well, uh, you know, mostly coffee. Tastes better, like Eskimos burying salmon heads, kimchi, fermented anything really tastes good. And he just used his beast boost dirty trick, and there's no boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger, because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message, because the messenger killed him. Ah, uh, going in circles. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. Second down and six. Third down and nine. Something going here. First and four. And picks up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I gotta, uh... <clears throat> hey, you gotta go. Uh, why are they stopping the clock for the offense, Grim? They're stopping it for their own offense. They're hungry for the ball, partner. The ball? The pigskin? Bacon! I'm hungry for bacon! And he rumbles into the end zone for the score. I hope he's not going to dance now. <laughs> and here comes the extra point attempt. for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one-time thing. In a hurry-up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. The quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just clock blocked the clock. And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And, it's, and that'll be their final timeout. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown!
Man, are these guys greedy or desperate? Either way, they're going for two. And he finds his target for two. If you think his dancing is bad, you should have been here in the old days. He used to mark their territory the old-fashioned way. But they agreed to dial it down to uh, interpretive dance. I took an interpretive dance class with a werewolf on Grim. He damn near clawed my face off. That was before the class even started. Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. The four people on the planet who care about rules and kickoffs must be happy to see a flag down. I'm just happy to see anything after that laser pointer accident. Yeah, like... The onside kick is a desperation play, but it's their only chance at this point to steal a position. Still, it ain't right, Grim. It just ain't right. And it's first and ten. And they just smacked that one back in his face. Second down and ten. The quarterback goes down. Zoom on his face. I want to see if he's crying. Third down and long.